Welcome. In front of me is a OnePlus 7T and today I'll show you how to enable the do not disturb mode. So there's a couple ways you could basically get it working. Uh, the first one most uh, convenient I guess is the switch right here and you have the um, right now it's on ring. If you slide it all the way up it's on silent which basically makes no sounds and then you have the vibrate. So I guess this would be uh, equivalent of do not disturb mode although the screen would be still enabled. Um, now the other way you can do it is by pulling down the notification panel and you'll find the do not disturb mode right here. And you can either enable it by default just by checking it on like so or by holding it and going into the settings where you can also set up a schedule. So just up on let's say on schedule and you have two different ones so event and sleeping just enable the sleeping one and then you can also tap here and see how it is set up so by default as you can see it's uh, basically seven days a week uh, time start at 10 p.m and end at 7 so basically at 10 p.m the device will go uh, do not disturb mode and at 7 in the morning it will get out of that mode and then you also have additional settings so alarm can override end time so if you for instance have a alarm set for 6 in the morning it will override the 7 a.m end and then you have the do not disturb mode uh, behavior so use default settings and you can also create custom settings for this schedule which will give you when you tap on it additional options so calls and messages allow when you tap on it you have uh, additional options so allow calls and you know, from anyone, contacts only, stared contacts which are favorite and uh, don't allow from anybody. Um, so that is each individual choice what they want to set. Um, probably the stared contacts would be the best one so only your favorite contacts can reach you while the do not disturb mode is active. Let's go back. And messages have the same uh, settings so you can choose that as well. Whichever one you like and then you have additional ones right here. So. Uh, allow alarms, uh, play media sounds, allow touch tones, and additional things. So as, you, as I said before, you can set up as however you like. And whatever you set right here will be individual to this specific schedule that we are right now for sleeping. Uh, if you set another one, um, for instance the event one, you can also set it to work differently than this one. So different settings, different options for like touch tones and uh, who can reach you depending on how you want to set it. You can also add more if you wish to, or you can set it up right here in the main page. Um, just the exceptions for calls, which we were doing in the uh, event one or actually sleeping one. Uh, so you can change here calls and uh, and uh, messages how how it uh, allows them or doesn't allow them and whenever then you enable the do not disturb mode by, do, do not disturb mode by default it will then take the uh, settings from here so yeah that is basically how you would set it up and if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching